Hi, today we discuss a question of time and speed distance, stream and boat. This video is not a concept video, but a suggestion video. When we have a journey of upstream and downstream and we have a time, another journey of upstream and downstream with a time and we have to find a speed of boat and a speed of river. Then we generally make equation of B minus S upstream and B plus S downstream. We solve the equations and get a value of B and S. My suggestion to you before solving these questions, just work on few concepts. If values from this concept satisfy the equation, then it's very good because we will save time. For the concept, we just write upstream distance of both downstream distance of both and time in the both the journey. We know B minus S is in common in upstream. So there should be something common in 35 and 15. The common factor of 35 and 15 is nothing but 5. We have B plus S common in both. So there is something common in 33 and 55 because we have to divide both values from the B plus S. The common value is 11. So whenever you have these type of question work on the common values, here the 5 and 5. So remove the 5, we have 7 left, we have 3 left. We assumed B minus S is 5. If B plus S is 11, remove 11, we have 3 and 5. Addition of 7 plus 3 is 10, addition of 3 plus 5 is 8, means we got our value. My suggestion is just work on a common factor of upstream and downstream. Remove that common factor by considering the value of that common factor is B minus S and B plus S. If this satisfy your equation, work on these values. If they didn't, either we adjust the value or we solve the equations. Here we have 7 plus 3 is 10 and 3 plus 5 is 8 means these values are satisfying our equation. So we can say B minus S is 5 and B plus S is 11. By solving these two, the boat is nothing but 5 plus 11 by 2 is 8. A stream is 11 minus 5 by 2 is 3. And we have to find the remainder when the 8 divided by 3 answer would be C. So my suggestion is, if you have upstream and downstream equation, first work on a common factor. If equation satisfied, then this is an easy question. If didn't satisfy, adjust the values or solve the equation. Okay, I hope it is clear. Thank you.